on the go. I am so full, but this food is so good. I don't want to waste any of it. This is special food from Elon. Why is it so special? Let's find out on the go. Many years ago, there was not enough food for everyone. People in Elon learned to cook and eat everything that could be cooked and eaten, from soup to bones. People learned to cook and eat almost everything that was on their plates. Nothing was wasted. This way of thinking gave cooks some new ideas to make special dishes. The cooks have just finished cooking the meat over the stoves. The top of the pot now has a layer of leftover soup and oil. Usually, these ingredients are thrown away, but not in this place. Can you believe that these leftovers make special dishes like gaoja? I think that we should find out how they do that. Let's go. Friends, today we have the honor to watch Chef Chen as he prepares gaoza. Now, what do we need for this dish? Different ingredients like duck eggs. We also have some shrimp and pork. Then we'll add different kinds of flour and cornstarch to the leftovers. Now let's watch. The gaoza is made with leftover meats, soup, oil, and fat. This dish is stirred and then left out to dry. Before it is served, it is stir-fried. Long ago, gaoza was a special food only for big banquets. Another special dish in Ilan is called zaobing. Now this dish has many unusual ingredients like pig's fat, kumquats, and sweet winter melon. Tian Donggua. First, the cooks mix all the ingredients together to make a dough. At the end, it's steamed and put into the refrigerator. Wow! This is the zaobing and this is the gaoja. You know, the gaoja is said to be like the people of Ilan. They are cold and unfriendly on the outside. But on the inside, they are warm and friendly. Let's try. Mm. Mm. It's delicious. It tastes kind of like fried ice cream. Mm. Let's try the zaobing. Mm. It's very chewy and sweet. And friends, there is more to eat. It's burning! I smell smoke! Oh! It's... Well, it's just smoked duck meat. Yashang. Yashang is another special dish here in Ilan. Do you want to learn about smoking meat? Well, follow me. Many years ago, it was very hard to keep meat fresh. So, people learned how to smoke meat and keep it fresh for a long time. Now this is where the meat is smoked. The meat is put inside this big wooden oven. The heat in the oven is what smokes the meat. Sugar cane. 
Now, why is sugar cane important when smoking duck meat? Well, let's find out. Whoa! Now, after the duck meat has been smoked for a while, the cooks put the sugar cane inside the wooden oven. Now, the sugar cane adds a very sweet flavor to the duck meat. This duck meat looks great. Hey, the bones are still in the meat. Now, why don't the cooks take the bones out? Did they forget? The bones stay in the meat to keep the flavor. They make the meat taste even better. After that, the meat is steamed and the bones are taken out. Now it's time to try the yashang. Let's see how the meat tastes. Mmm, it's really good. The meat is chewy and a little sweet. Do you want some? <laughs> well, thank you all for joining me today as we learned more about some special food here in Ilan. We'll see you next time on the go.